Hey guys, it is pretty late at night, but that's because my kids had to be asleep before I did this video. With that said, this is not a kid-friendly video. If there's kids around or kids who can hear this video, turn it off now. Like, <laughs> just turn it off. Not a kid video. I thought it would be fun to do a YouTube video kind of like mean tweet style. You know where celebrities read the mean tweets that people have said about them or have tweeted about them. I thought it'd be fun to do like mean YouTube comments. So I took about a week's worth of YouTube comments, mostly from my divorce video. I just like thumbed through some of the, some of the comments. And yeah, so <laughs> here goes. If you were my wife, I would use drugs 24 seven. This bitch has major issues. She needs to get a job and show us her tits. Hashtag no condom. Make a video showcasing yo sexy ass feet. I bet you didn't give him good head. You need some serious help. You're the worst storyteller ever and you make men hate women like you. Wow, psych ward, there you go. This one's actually really good. Somebody put a lot of effort into this comment. It's pretty long, so here goes. For candid mom, sorry you went through this. Shit happens. How did you not know his friends? For the audience, so for you guys. Don't do drugs while dating a millennial. They will hang you out to dry on social media. For candid mom, please go to therapy. You need it, seriously. For the audience, how in the hell did this end up on my list? I was searching for reef tanks. Yeah, I don't know YouTube's algorithms. For YouTube, oh, fix your shit, assholes. This new search engine sucks meth. I didn't read that. For Candid Mom, please go to therapy. You need it, seriously. For audience, thumbs up. Yeah, I'm not sure why this video is recommended for me. This was my account for saving fetish porn on YouTube. I did watch a good portion of the video though. Your husband was doing meth? What a fucking idiot. I want to make sex with her hiney. M-G-T-O-W. Google it. Fucking loser. This is why women get beat. Can we see your butt? This woman represents everything that is wrong about modern society. And YouTube. Go fucking kill yourself. L-M-A-O. Because you're ugly, that's why. <laughs> what a stupid, ugly bitch. And why do people care about this I can't say this word. <laughs> I'm trying so hard to keep a straight face. This is a hard one. Come dumpsters. <laughs> Divorce. Whew, that's a hard one. <laughs> I don't. I've never seen that spelled out before. Or probably ever even. I've never heard it. Okay. I'm here only to say, women shouldn't have rights. They're only on earth for breeding. You're not pretty. <laughs> what a spoiled bitch. <laughs> this one's long. <laughs> Come dumpster. <laughs> okay. Whew. I'm really trying to be serious. Okay. <laughs> what is wrong with you? In the, the, the loud words are all caps. This video shows why you, why your husband does not want you. My God, get it together and get a life. Why are you divorcing? You have children. Why are you divorcing? That was, that was in there twice. You have no right to rip your kid's family apart. You are the problem. Listen to yourself. P-A-T-H-E-T-I. Please get yourself laid. Honestly, would do you a lot of good. You are a shameless cunt. Thank you, Game of Thrones, for making me comfortable saying that word. Woo. I actually got a hard on when she started crying. Wah, I got divorced, boo hoo, grow the f up. This one, I'm not gonna read the entire thing, but there is, there is, um, <laughs> okay, one word, F U. Honky? I, I've never heard this one. Cracka. N word? B word. Western women are fing trash. 
you're a selfish bitch who is detro destroying her children. Okay, one more. <laughs> your suffering with your marriage is going to be peanuts compared to your suffering in hell, you maggot. Okay, that's, that's just a week's worth of fun. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I know that this is a video unlike anything I've ever done. I kind of really honestly just want to bring some awareness to some of the things that are said on YouTube. Well, it doesn't affect me. I know that it could probably affect a lot of people out there and it's not okay. So if you know somebody who's leaving comments like this or if you yourself are doing them, think about the person actually receiving them. Not everybody receives them as well as I do and you could really be hurting somebody. So maybe um, refocus some of that energy to to something that may just be a bit more productive or good, good in our world. So anyways, um, I'm not gonna say that I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I am gonna say that that's probably more swear words than I've said in the last five years combined. And yeah, so anyways, on that note, I will talk to you guys later. <laughs> Bye.